Hey guys, these are the three most common questions that I get from traders that I have met literally all over the world. It seems like people are always asking me these three. So uh, the first thing that most people ask me is, can anyone do this? That's a great question. And the answer is no. Just like in any other job or business, there is a learning curve to trading. You have to think of this as a job, right? So just like you're becoming a doctor or a lawyer or an accountant or even the job you have right now, there was a certain amount of learning to do and some people are good at it or some people are not. Trading is the same way. I don't personally believe that you have to have some huge, crazy, massive intellect or come from the right background or have so much money to become a trader, but I do think that you have to attack your study just like you would if you were going to university to learn a real profession. And so that means you're gonna have to spend months to learn what you wanna do and how you're gonna trade, and then you've gotta spend so much time honing your skills, right? Just because you get your first job when you're done with college doesn't mean that you're a pro yet. And trading is the same way. At some point you'll be done learning and you'll be making money, but you still won't be the best. There's the years of experience that comes in to be really an elite trader. So that's one of the most common things that I hear all the time. I do believe that most of us have the aptitude to do it, but many don't because they don't attack it like it's a job. The next part that uh, I think is really important, I get this question all the time is, how much money can I make? Isn't that the best one, right? How much money can I make? Everybody just wants to know that, right? They wanna jump right to the end. Well, the only thing that you're guaranteed in trading in terms of making money is none. For most of my students in the beginning, I'd be happy if they made one dollar, one damn dollar. Because I know if you can make one, you can scale it into a hundred or even a thousand dollars a day. But the hardest part in trading to learn is just how to win. How do you go from knowing nothing to actually going and making a little bit of money every day, finishing in the green? See, if you can make one dollar a day, then you're winning. And that means you're a winner in trading. And that's a good habit to have. We can build on it. But to get there takes months of study and then practice time on the simulator then you've got to go in live and then we start to see that income flow in so that's always a question that I always get a chuckle at because everybody wants to just know like you meet somebody and it's like how much money do you make it's the weirdest question to ask right the smart question would be when you talk to somebody is what are the steps I need to take to start learning how to make money and that's where we can really dig in deep and then the third question that I get just all the time from uh, anybody that uh, I talk to is just, uh, what softwares and scanners do you use? New traders always assume that it's the software or the scanner that gives you the edge, right? Like, give me the scans, because like, if I have the scans, I'll just have all this money. Well. That's a common mistake and has nothing to really do with trading. Scanning is 1% of trading. See, all a scan does is it takes 8,000 tickers and it turns them into say 10 or 15. But once you have that 10 or 15, what are you gonna do with it, right? You still gotta know how to enter them and exit them, plan out the trade, do your risk management, everything else that goes into a trade. A scanner is just a small portion of it. For my scanning and charting, I use TC2000. I believe that's the best charting platform out there because you can make watch lists, write your own scans. They've got clear, vibrant charts. It even hooks to their own brokers. You can trade from there. Uh, I've used that software for over a decade and it's the only thing that I think I couldn't live without as a trader. Uh, for my actual scanning, if I'm looking for intraday scans, uh, I also use trade ideas, uh, which can help you scan for gappers and earnings plays. But my number one that I always use because I need the charts is TC2000, and I use trade ideas as a supplement. But when you're brand new, none of that stuff matters, right? It's about finding a handful of really, really good stocks and then learning what to do with them. That's how you're gonna make money.